Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you sort of like a DIY video and I'm going to be showing you how to make your very own um, dropped armhole tank top. And if you guys don't know what that is, that's basically like the armhole of your tank top that's like super duper dropped and you would basically wear just a bandeau underneath it and I think it's super cute and super in for the summer this year. So I decided um, I'll make a video about it to kind of show you guys how to do it. It's super simple. So this is a t-shirt that I'm going to be using and it says give peace a chance and I fringed these a while ago this is going to be the t-shirt that I will be using to kind of make that um, dropped armhole tank top and that shirt is also cropped I recommend you guys um, using like an old t-shirt or something just any t-shirt that you rarely wear that's just stuck in the back of your closet and once you kind of do that tank top dropped armhole cutout that I'll, I will be showing you guys it just looks 100% better okay, so first what you want to do is kind of just lay out your t-shirt on a flat surface like the floor or the table or whatever you're going to use and I just kind of you know aligned right here make sure it's all aligned and it's super flat and kind of stretch it out a, a little bit just so that we ensure that when you cut it it's not going to look um, different on the other side than it is on the front so after I flip that I'm going to go ahead and cut the neckline and a lot of people like the neckline like a crew neck and then just make that dropped armhole. That looks super cute as well. But I kind of just want this area to be cut just so that it gives a little bit of a laid back look. I don't know if that makes any sense, but I just like this cut better instead of just a crew neck cut. Go ahead and take my scissors and normally what you would do is kind of take a marker or a white crayon in my case because my t-shirt is black and kind of just outline the area where you want to cut. But I'm not going to do that for this shirt. You could do that if you want a nice precise line. I'm not going to do it too close to the shoulder because we are going to be cutting this area as well. got a white color print so I'm going to be using this to kind of outline where I want the cut cut out to be. I'm going to kind of outline where I want my straps to be and I kind of just want them not too thin or not too thick so about an inch and a half. So I kind of just drew a line going down like this and then you kind of want to draw a straight line going down like going down so don't curve it like this and kind of connect it right there. You just kind of want to bring the line down and keep going straight. And then right where you want the armhole to stop, that's where you're going to be making a curve like this. Hopefully you guys will see that curve like right there. A little bit better, so I just brought it straight down and then I made it curve right there. This is the finished tank top look. I'll give you guys a better look right now. So this is the finished product and I think it looks super cute. It came out really nice actually. Um, you can see the armholes are super deep but you would definitely have to wear it with a bandeau underneath which would look so cute. And mine are cropped and they're kind of fringed but it doesn't matter what kind of t-shirt you guys use. It doesn't have to be fringed or cropped. It could be a super tacky t-shirt and you guys can make it look a thousand times better um, just by creating this cut. Thanks so much for watching. If you guys have any other DIY um, requests or like video requests, just leave it in the, in the comments below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!